As if our daily actions aren't controlled enough, there's a growing number of individuals who just can't wait any longer to push us into a full-blown cashless society. Does having every single transaction you make monitored sound like a dream come true to you? I came across this article that I thought many of you would enjoy. As so often happens with these kinds of articles, some of the comments at the bottom are actually more valuable than the main article itself. Nonetheless, I appreciate the comedic relief this type of op-ed provides after a long week at the office. Please let me highlight some of my favorite parts and I'll also post a link below for those of you who care to enjoy more of this wonderful article entitled Why Gold Will Eventually Be Almost Worthless. Here are some of my favorite highlights. What gold did once, technology now does better. 90% of gold produced each year is used for jewelry and investments. That means that almost all the demand is based on the archaic idea of gold as a universal store of value. It's no longer necessary to store value in an inefficient format like gold. A small lightweight piece of plastic can reveal the value you own in the form of currency anywhere there is an internet connection, eliminating gold's usefulness. More than half of the world's demand for gold comes from India and China, where there is 13% and 1.1% broadband, respectively. So basically, internet access will drive more people away from gold and into virtual money, <laughs> according to the author. The internet is barely 10 years old and has yet to truly reach the masses. Someday, you'll see those gold coins, jewelry, and bars in the same way that you now look at a set of encyclopedias, Beanie Babies, or even a Blackberry. 